World Series champion. Hunter Pack. He's sending one over the wall, sadly. He's thrown behind Hunter. All right, so it's Saturday and we got a busy day ahead of us. First, we're going to the MLB Oceanfront event at Santa Monica Pier. And then after that, we're going to Dodger Stadium for the Futures game and the Celebrity game. We had a barbecue in San Jose in May with some friends drinking. Hey, I'm Jay. We're at the Santa Monica Pier today for the MLB Oceanfront. Let's go ahead and get started. doing good. I'll do a French dip sandwich in, um, for here. And can I do beef? And uh, can I do chips on the side for that as well? And then I'll just do, I'll just do a water. Um, let's just do a bottle. And then uh, for the chips, I'll do the Miss Vicky ones. Yep, get the jalapenos. And then can I get uh, the hot mustard on the side as well? Thank you. Nope, that'll be it. Okay, so we're at Philippe's and they are known for their French dip sandwiches. They actually believe that it started with Philippe's. And so we got a single French dip sandwich here today with beef and we got the au jus sauce and a side of the hot mustard. So let's go ahead and try it for the first time. All right. First bite, here we go. Mm. That's really, really good. I have rope beef sandwiches back at home, homemade ones with au jus sauce. This is, this is really, really good. Wow, let's go ahead and try it in the au jus. That's really, really good. I like it with the mustard too. Got horseradish mustard. I think the sandwich itself, give it like, Eight and a half. Aju sauce makes it a lot easier to, like, like I said, do a food challenge with it. Challenge with it, you can like wash it down. So I'd say that would be. I think you would put it at nine as well, like in and out yesterday, with the spicy or the hot mustard. I'd say I'd put it. I put it at an eight and a half. I don't think it adds much. I mean, the spice is cool. I'm not a huge horseradish guy, but I can deal with that because of the, the mustard part of it. I think that's why though, but I think overall I would give it, I'd give it a nine though. I'd give it a nine like the in and out I think that's what I'd do. All right, so we're heading into Dodger Stadium for the first time ever. Absolutely stoked. I mean, just look at this place. Look at this place, look at all the palm trees. Sunny outside, I got the shades on, got the sunscreen on, little PSA, wear your sunscreen. These rays are no joke out here. 
<laughs> so, man. Okay, so we're here for the Futures game and we got Bobby Miller, a Dodgers prospect, on the mound. I did not realize he was start, but that's pretty sweet. Kind of looks like Walker Jr. in my opinion, just the tatted up version. Alright, here's his first pitch. Straight gasoline, baby. I spotted the Marlins guy, there he is. He's inevitable. <laughs> Can't escape him. What a, what a play. He tracked that ball, man. Nice. So I go to get a water, and as soon as I do that, they hit two home runs while I'm gone. Literally nothing else had really happened. That just happens to be my good luck today, I guess. Okay, so that does it for the Futures game. The American won it six to four, and now we got the Celebrity game afterwards. So let's go ahead and get in that. Indeed. All right, so we're at Dodger Stadium, which means we have to get a Dodger dog for the first time. I'm kind of excited, I can't lie. I haven't had a hot dog in a while. It's been a while, so. Impression, so I mean, it's cool. I would say we gotta throw in the condiments still, a little ketchup, a little mustard. I mean, I mean, what, what is a what is a Dodger dog without ketchup and mustard, right? The big reveal. There it is. It's a big wiener right there. <laughs> All right, here we go. Here we go. Oh crap, that's too much ketchup. Oh gosh. I butchered it, I butchered it. Oh, is the mustard coming out? Uh-oh. Are we out of mustard? Uh, no mustard. All right, here we go. We got the mustard packed up. Oh, oh, oh. This just got butchered, man. All right. What I have to do. All right, I think it's time. I think it's time. We're gonna go this side. A little wiener sticking out on that side. Here we go. I mean, TBH. Just another hot dog. But it's a Dodger dog, so I'll give it. I'll give it like a seven and a half. It would have been a seven. Which is I like hot dogs, but the half I'll give it because it's a Dodger dog. So, but yes, a lot more. We're actually I mean, for to enter right what now. more can you do with a hot dog, dog really, besides really just grill it or, or, or make it longer, right? <laughs> Oh, he almost went out of the actual game. 
like over the actual wall. <laughs> I caught it. I caught it. I told you he would hit a home run. Oh god. Jojo is awful. <laughs> That's two missed balls in there. Wow. Yeah! Big poppy, let's go. Locked up on the infield. Oh, shit. Lorenzo scores. All right, so this day was absolutely incredible. Got to go to the oceanfront at Santa Monica Pier and then come over here for the Futures game and Celebrity game. And the Celebrity game was actually really, really good. And uh, it was a 15 to 13 game. Normally they aren't close. And just overall, it was just amazing. I mean, you always wanted to go to Dodger Stadium since you're a little kid and then you finally get to do it. And uh, it's, it's just been an awesome time. So, I mean, uh, I'll be back here soon, but uh, yeah, that's it for today, guys.